Watch just a few minutes of these stars on screen and you might think, wow, they're ridiculously good looking. Some of them just have natural sexiness, while others spent years refining their image on runways and magazine covers before hitting the big screen. Robert Pattinson, Mark Wahlberg and Cameron Diaz are just a few examples of models turned actors. Let's have a look at some more pretty faces who are taking Hollywood by storm. It's no secret that Rosie Huntington Whiteley was a former Victoria's Secret model before debuting in Transformers Dark of the Moon. In fact, the stunning model was discovered when director Michael Bay shot a Victoria's Secret commercial in 2010. And even though she had already worked with Michael and wasn't afraid to stand in front of a camera, it took some time for Rosie to get used to the movie industry. It's a totally different, um, totally different thing coming from a fashion background where you go on set and you work at a reasonable hour and you're working with a beautiful set, maybe it's a beach, maybe it's a clean studio, you know, you're beautiful, you've got beautiful clean clothes on and you know, you're running around being pretty and, and, and clean and fresh. And then you land headfirst onto a Michael Bay set, which, you know, most of the time we're filming on sets that look like the end of the world. We're down back dirty alleys, we're hot, we're sweaty, we're exhausted, we're working 17 hour days, five days a week, for seven months in a row. And there'd be this moment every morning where I'd get done up. And then my makeup artist would just have to destroy me to make me look like I'd been running around Chicago trying to save the world for the last three days. So it was a really interesting contrast. Yep, it's not easy to be a movie star. But hey, we think the blonde beauty still did a fantastic job. Rosie's next big screen adventure came a couple of years later in the form of 2015's Mad Max Fury Road, in which she can be seen alongside Charlize Theron, also a former model. The South African beauty scooped a one-year modeling contract at a local competition aged just 16. She then spent a year working throughout Europe before spells in both New York and Miami. At 19, Theron flew to LA on a one-way ticket her mother bought her, and the rest is kind of history, including an Oscar win for her performance in Monster. For that role, she gained 30 pounds to transform from a gorgeous skinny Dior model into an unattractive, chubby, mentally ill woman. A star who definitely does not look like a monster is Iowa-born actor Ashton Kutcher. He may be a goof on the big screen, but he can get away with it thanks to those good looks of his. Back in college, Ashton took home the first prize in the Fresh Face modeling competition, which inspired him to move to New York and chase a life in the industry. The two and a half men star popped up in Calvin Klein ads and walked runways all over Europe. <laughs>